Hey everybody and today I am back here with Title Tuesday once again. How is everybody doing long time not seen? Hopefully you are doing well. Let's have fun and let's go. Again, how is everybody? Okay, 70 sound. I actually didn't didn't try to make it manually. I just had it on 70 for whatever reason. So I don't mind. So hi everybody. Hope you're doing well. Thank you, Animus Gifter, for two gifted communities, uh, for two gifted subs to community seven days ago and 14 days ago. Appreciate it. Uh, and yeah, the tournament starts in three and a half minutes. So far, there is a little less than 500 players registered. Hi, Karma, what's up? How are you? Five hundred players, okay. Players joining. I use the seven karma. I think it's fine. But let me know if it isn't. Five ten. My prediction is that we'll have like six sixty five players or something like that. I'm not sure exactly, but I think around around that number. Like what is I'm fine. Okay, nice. I have regular water, so I'm also pretty okay. Hey, Donax. Okay, 550. Wow. We may actually get 700 players. I'm not like a hundred percent sure, but it's a possibility. Five sixteen, like I don't know, Le ten players in less than five seconds. That's quite a lot. So maybe we'll get seven hundred players when the tournament begins. I post here. Yes, yeah. Okay. I'm doing fine, Zalma. How about you? Does the camera look better? Hold on this or this? Chat. I think maybe this is better. I don't know. I think the camera is a bit closer. I don't know. There's not much difference, but okay. I think this is a tiny bit better. I mean, this or this. I think I'll keep this. I don't know. I think that's a tiny bit better because the camera is 10 bit. 620! Wow! Yeah, we'll get in 700 for sure this, this today. 626. I think this should be fine. It's fine. Okay. I mean, it's like such a minimal, minimal d d d difference. I see someone flying. It's either a mosquito and I'll get fully bitten while playing the tournament, or it's some small bug. I don't know. Uh, it's definitely not a fly. Just gonna pray that it's not a mosquito. I mean, I don't want to get bitten, but okay. We'll see. 660, wow, today so many players. Karma is a stream lagging? I'm not sure. It very well may be lagging. It says it's pretty fine. Maybe, no, 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 it's not that big. No, no, no. <laughs> Hopefully not, at least. Karma is a stream fine or no? Why is it lagging? So far it's not lagging. Maybe it's all my two internet then. Or maybe I'm having some small lags as well, I don't know. Uh, come on, 15 players. 11 in 11 seconds. A player, a second is doable for sure. But the players aren't just joining. 692. I uh, didn't even start with 700. Such a shame, shot. Okay. Emote only it is. And let's go. Oh, this guy, I can't, this guy's account must build because it's just a three name. No, it's 2020. Because I thought uh, three, uh, three long, uh, no, three characters long account should be quite rare, you know, because I literally, and the word, word I see is pretty popular. But this guy, this guy registered his account in 2020, so I guess it's not that rare after all. Because usually the rarest accounts are like one, two, three uh, characters. So, but okay. I guess I see maybe it wasn't a popular word for people to create account with. 
And we get Cozy for first round chat. Um, yes, it's Queen D3. If I recall correctly. Ah, this guy doesn't like Knight G5. Okay, now I don't remember. Yes, it did. Or, chat, is the stream here or no? It looks like it's here. Ah, uh, but okay. It's here. Okay, it's back, I think. I'm not sure what happened. Uh, I spent a lot of time trying to figure out what happened, so let's just make a move. I mean, it looks like it, it looks like it's back. I'm gonna pause that so it doesn't lag the internet. I crushed dummy. Uh, mm, 95 I get taken and queen h5 f5. Bishop f5 was an option, but I wanna keep the queens. Jimmy is alive or no? I mean, it looks like it's alive. But then it also looked like he was alive and then you, it died suddenly. Okay, it's it's fine. Okay, good. Okay, rook eight. Developing the pieces. I'm tempted. I'm so tempted. If knight of three, I'm gonna take. If knight e4, I might take. Eh. I might take. I might not take as well. Aha. Uh -huh. I mean, I guess queen d8. <laughs> Don't know. Something like bishop g4 or knight. No, knight g4 isn't good, but something like bishop g4 with a peace sacrifice was a bit interesting. But I don't have enough time to calculate deep enough to understand if I go for it or not. Okay, he comes back. It's for sure fine with a draw, but I want to try to play. He wants to play knight e4. How do I play for an advantage? That's a question. Four bishop of eight, and we don't trade the queens. <laughs> Surely it doesn't look the most pleasant, even compared to the position two moves ago, for example. Am I just lost after queen h5? I don't know. Okay, knight g6. Yeah, surely. I wanted to play for an advantage, but I think <laughs> I'm playing for his advantage. <laughs> Not for my own advantage, unfortunately. That's knight e6. Oh, and f5 hangs. I missed that. Oops. And for some. Oh, hold on. Doesn't this win a piece after queen d2? Is my question. Queen d2? And this and these things. Thanks for stuff, Logan, for 28 months. Appreciate it. There is two years and four months. Thank you, Logan. How are you doing? But this looks like I do win a piece. So it was all calculated, Chad. Chad, it was all calculated in advance. I 
I, I'm telling you it was all calculated. Mm -hmm. I need a Zenf we need. Perfect calculation. Um, I mean, I suppose I take B2 and an A2 and a Queen G8. Yeah, that was such a perfect calculation, you don't know how perfect it was until you see it. <laughs> I mean, for sure it wasn't, it wasn't such a lucky coincidence that all that happened. No, no, it was all deep calculation. But Queen D6 is a good move, no? Maybe Queen D6 is a fine move. Uh, okay. Yeah, Queen D6 is better. But somehow I always find Queen D8 more comfortable to play. I take Queen H4 immediately, but Queen H4, Rook E4, for example. Queen F6, so not much. Split. Okay, Stockfish says I should have forced a draw. Openly Bishop of 8 and lose a pawn. Okay, so I definitely was ambitious playing for an advantage. Yeah, here, yeah, Queen H5 I'm lost. The idea is if this, he gets Knight F6, Bishop F6, here, 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 mate. That's what I was afraid of. And yeah, let's really have a good move here. G6, he has Knight F6. Take, take, and then Bishop E5. Uh, and if uh, I play Knight G6, then he can somehow sacrifice. Queen G6, Bishop H6, Rook E7. Rook D1, only move? I mean, it's hard to find. It leads this line. But he's better since the, the, his idea pretty much. Okay, I go Queen E8. He goes Rook E7. And if I take, he takes on G7 twice, takes D7, takes C7. Something like this. And takes D7, C7. Uh, and if I go Queen to G6, it's pretty much the same story, only he takes G7. So that's, I mean, it's complicated to find in blitz, but yeah, Queen E5 definitely was a good try. Play Bishop of 1, IG6, this is his, I got a worse position, F5, blunder. Okay, that's not a mosquito, that's good. Uh, okay, Rook E7. I mean, honestly, Bishop C6 feels better human-wise. Ah, uh, then rook e7, and it's easier to find. Uh, wait, did I turn off? Okay, hi, hi, everybody. Queen h5, but this threat is something like knight moves and bishop g6. And yeah, I'm not great. But okay, I played f5, he played knight c5, rook d1 was better. And if I move, he takes f5. If I take e4, he takes c6. Yeah, that was a terrible position. And then queen f5, blunder. Yeah, he simply had to take. I would take, take, take. Bishop f5, let's say, I don't know. Okay, rook b2, for example. Here, 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 rook a2. But he has much better uh, piece activity, and he would be much better. But he ended up playing queen to f5. And I was thinking about playing bishop c5, queen e2. But then I shot for a bit, and I found that the best move order is takes this and win a piece. Yeah, quite lucky. But okay, a win is a win. All carefully right from one, move one. Exactly. Very well said, Karmar. Hi, Pookie. Yeah, well, Logan, exactly. Hi, Logan, as well. Hi, to Hi, everybody. What's up? Dun, dun, dun. There is one more game, I think. Oh, no, there is no games. Okay, chat. It was a win, yes. It was a win. Indeed. Okay. White pieces. And let's try to to play for a good result. I mean, it was a win, it was all calculated, for sure, from the move, from move one, chat. If you think otherwise, then, well, you're wrong. It was all absolutely calculated from move one. As Karma said. Karma already knows, knows the drill, you know. If it's a win, everything was calculated. If it's a loss, it was calculated, but I miscalculated, you know? <laughs> I thought you wrote something in chat and I was like, hold on, I turn on emote only. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> because this emoji looks like an actual message on dark mode. Um, if 95 I'm gonna take with this side, I think. Or not. 
That's not, it's not displaced well. Yeah, I might do this in an A4. Hi, Snoopy Dog. He wants to go knight f4, I guess. H2, maybe or Queen F3, I'm not sure. Maybe King H2 is better. Because um, I might want to get the F, have the F3 square for my knight in case things go south. So I think King H2. Because Queen F3, there may be some lines, see something like this, Bishop G4, which may be unpleasant. I mean, it's stupid, of course, but ah, I don't know. King H2 feels a bit more safer. If bishop e5, then I might consider queen f3. Um, the problem is this, I cannot play b4 since c3 hangs. Mm. Mm. I mean, I guess now it's time to play queen f3. I realize it. I mean, I can't play bishop e2 if I'm that scared of bishop g4, you know? That takes I have queen g4 at the end of the line. Uh, but yeah, I might want to play bishop e2, b4, so that c3 is protected, and then do something. I don't know what, but maybe I can do something. Or e5, bishop e4, b4. e5, b4 looks interesting since c3 isn't hanging anymore. I don't know. But e5 allows, allows bishop d5, so... Uh. <laughs> okay, now my knight is hanging. Gotta keep that in mind, you know, while calculating. Okay, so queen e2 is an option, b4 is an option as well. What if I play b4, queen c6, e5, I know he gets rook d3 there, so that's not good. So perhaps I should simply play queen e2. Because yeah. otherwise if I move my knight, he gets queen e5. And I cannot take a 4 since... <sighs> I blundered. So I should have played knight e2, giving away opponents, it seems. <laughs> Okay. Go here so that he can take queen. Ah, but yes, f3. Ay. Then rook e3, I guess. Doesn't look great, but the thing I'm hoping for is that I have a bit more time. So maybe in time trouble he may uh, blunder. Wow. Mm -hmm. Wow. So queen c4, he plays f3. For example, I play queen f1, he plays bishop e5, king h1, queen g3. Wow. Nasty. <laughs> yeah, so I should have played queen e2. <sighs> yeah, two blunders in a single game isn't good. <laughs> Hmm. I'll try King G1. Maybe he miscalculated, I'm not sure. Dear. <laughs> But I cannot take, okay, yes, rook f6, simply. Cannot take twice on f3, okay. Yeah. 
Not the best game I've played, for sure. Maybe he blunders perpetual? Nope, he doesn't. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> that was very poor played for me. It's very, very poorly played. Maybe he blunders the promotion? Nope. Okay, now, 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 let's try some stalemate tricks. You know? Maybe they work. No, they don't because there is none. Yeah. Yeah, but I would simply blunder Queen C5 with Rook D3 idea. Unfortunate. Yeah, good game. Even though it wasn't good for me, he played it very well. Mm. But I don't know. I mean, after Queen C5. If I play before he gets queen c6 and queen e2 bishop c3, and if I'm off he gets bishop c3 as well. And also, yeah, I guess I simply had to play knight d2 or something, sacrifice the pawn. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, but gotta give credit to him, he played this game very well. Wow, four moves in a row were mistakes. Rook d1 was the first one. King h2 was the second one. I should have played king h1. Yeah, king h1, was, now that I look at it, it was better. Because, say, for example, this exact line. I go knight a3, queen a5, queen f4 is possible. I don't go under this unpleasant pin. Rook d8, queen f3 was a mistake. I should have played knight d2, giving away a pawn. But I didn't want to give away a pawn. Um, and rook d3, brilliant. And the queen f2 was a very nice move he spotted. I tried something, but uh, it was... It was too bad. There wasn't really anything. Yeah. Well done from him. Yeah, Kinesh one was better. Kinesh two just walked. I mean, it's hard to spot uh, because I thought Kinesh one may walk under some I don't know f three bishop h three f three queen g two check. Now that I think about it, it was just stupid that I thought so. But okay. Hmm. Unfortunate blunder from white, the time trouble. <laughs> white was the one playing for a win, but they ended up losing. Yeah, but there is nothing I can do when I analyze the games. So sorry that the engine makes the stream lag. Sorry about that. Nothing can be done, I think. Unless you have some idea, which I don't know. It would be... Would be welcome if you would recommend it, but I'm not sure if there is any solution to that issue. <laughs> okay, now it's just a game where white is trying to trick black into winning blundering the rook, which is unlikely to happen. Oh, but black flagged! So the gamble paid off from white. <laughs> that was a nice gamble. I'm thinking if I would panic a tiny bit. But there's rook g8. Okay, black, maybe Cosio chat. Maybe I can get a Cosio. No Cosio, okay. Uh -huh. So it's like English. Okay, it's double. Is it hippo? Yeah. Surely looks like. Yeah, yeah. It's a hippo. Okay, how do you break the hippo? Or is it not the hippo? If if d3 is played, then it's a hippo. But no d3 is played, so it's not a hippo. Whether it's somewhat a hippo, it's not like full hippo. Logic is not logic in here. Um, but yeah. I mean, the idea of if we just to keep the D pawn weak. Shabba 5. Maybe Queen G6 was slightly better. I don't know. Uh, okay, Queen H6 looks interesting. But the thing is, there is C5. Thank you for the follow. Uh, there might be C5. So I might simply return and play Knight E5. Since, yeah, I mean, it looks fine, at least queen d8. I think I'm not blundering anything, hopefully. 
because queen e6, there is c5. I mean, sure, I have bishop e5, but I also want that square for my knight. And queen on h6 isn't doing much. Okay, sure, maybe queen on d8 is preventing my rooks from getting to d8, for example. But I don't. I like that a bit more. Uh, what can I play here? Um, 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 I can play knight b4. But is that good for me or no? That's a question. Night before, mm -hmm. I guess. Yes, it is okay. But night before at the same time also doesn't look okay because my bishops cannot do really anything. Can't really do anything. So, what if I play rook e5, rook e6 maybe? Okay, I'll go rook e6 and queen c2, queen e8. I have three takes here. Yeah, rookie six wasn't a good move. Nine before would have been better, I think. But I have two bishops as well in charge. <laughs> After knight d4, I won't have it. But at this exact moment, with the position maybe a bit passive, but I have two bishops advantage. So, always gotta find the positives. Maybe I can do something with them. I don't know what, but maybe I can. Okay, rookie one. Takes. Right now, bishop on g6 is very important and valuable. Actually, I don't mind this position as much anymore. Uh, I, I, I'm wondering whether I should go to a5 or b6 with my queen. a5 attacks a pawn, b6 doesn't do anything, so I'm leaning more towards the a5 square. But queen e5, d5. But queen b6, d5 as well, so let's go queen a5. Okay, mm, I guess. Yes, this past one can be unpleasant. But so far it's not that as unpleasant, so I can deal with it. <coughs> Bishop b7, queen b6, I take d6, it's fine. Uh, queen b6 anyways. Mm, queen b6, rook d1, queen e3, take, take. This may be dubious. I don't know what to play. <laughs> I don't know, H6 is it? I have King H7 maybe? Blundered. 
I oh, know wait, I've bishop before. What am I talking about? I did I have eight this to attack. Ah. This should win if I'm not hallucinating. I think this should be a winning game. Okay. okay, one on time. No, okay. Is this winning or did I hallucinate into a draw? Okay, it's winning. But yeah, with some would struggle. <laughs> yeah, okay, you go around here, 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 and you're winning this in time. Uh, yeah, okay, that was a messy game, but uh, when you see when it was all calculated from the beginning, chat. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Of course I got better from the opening. Evo was actually a mistake. Yes, it was fine, more or less. Oh, queen g4 here. h5 actually was winning. <laughs> okay, and then like rookie 2? Yeah. Could you take the h1 instead of going around? I couldn't, could I? I think I couldn't. Hold on. Since... No, here gh draws because this should be a draw since if f1 is taken so it's like king f4 it's already a draw um my idea was okay rook a3 rook a3 like okay g4 f4 push this rook f6 ah oh god yeah yeah i could have played king f5 I don't know why I played king e5 and it simply takes the pawn. Because here I cannot take the pawn since king e4 it's a draw. King e4 it's self, it otherwise it's a draw. So I could, what I could have done as well, I think, is triangulate. And then here go king e5. No, this... Yeah, and then this wins. Yeah. Oh, it's round start already. So it was an interesting game. I mean, I think I could, but if the king is on g6, I can take already, of course. Uh, but before, no, but I should have simply played king f5 and then g4, king g5. I just wasted a, an, an important tempo on the. Uh, on king e5, king f5, because then, then g4 is a draw because king h4 is still made. So I should play king f5 immediately. Okay, bishop e6 is interesting. Um, is d4 a move here? I'm sure it is, but is it a good move? 
Saki in a pawn. Ah, I mean, it's interesting for sure. Huh. I'm tempted actually. I don't know. Okay, chat, I'm tempted to go d4. It may be just a stupid pawn loss, it may be. Or it may be a genius move. Maybe as well. So we'll see. Or I could have simply played b3, bishop b2, and then like knight e2, d4. And no problems! But I'm complicating things for no reason whatsoever. <laughs> but for content. I mean, you gotta do... You gotta do things for content for sure. You know? Okay, rookie one. I'm not taking an exchange. Sorry. Didn't go into my plans. My idea is to play d5, queen e4, win a bishop. That's my idea. Um, if he plays bishop, e bishop a6, I mean, my idea is gone. So I don't have an idea no more. And he plays bishop a6. So right now I'm simply a pawn down. But this is simply a pawn chat. No. It's fine. Uh, can I do this in 84? I think so. 96 idea to make him to make him uh, to take away his right to castle. Um, he can take take bishop of eight, but then he wasted a lot of tempies. So I mean, it may, the gamble may be worse. Oh, he plays bishop of eight immediately. Ooh, ooh. Okay, I like that. I like that. I don't mind. I don't mind that. So what's his idea? He can play knight e7. He might want to play bishop e7 or bishop d3 right, right at the exact moment. What can I play? <laughs> I mean, it's interesting, you know? I sucked a pawn for this position. <laughs> I mean, at the end of the day, it may not even be better or anything, and I'm like so excited and hyped about it. But I'm like queen e4. The idea is if he goes queen to a5, I'm gonna take, take a knight e5. I get my pawn back, but look at his pieces, you know? I mean, I mean, I, if you say these pieces are great, then I'm not sure how great they are. I mean, look at my knights and pieces. Okay, maybe these pieces, these three pieces are good, but my knights and the bishop on d are great. So, ah, it's interesting. And if he goes queen d7, there is rook d1. And the bishop, okay, he goes here, but then can't I simply take knight e5? Knight e5, bishop b5. Uh, yeah, maybe I cannot really simply take. Maybe it will be a bit more complicated. But it surely is fun. It is fun for sure. No, I cannot take, I think. But I can play knight c3 perhaps. Knight c3, queen b4, knight e5, knight queen e4. Ah, maybe it's not the best. Maybe I should play bishop d2. I don't know. Maybe b3. Pum, 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 pum. I don't know. Again, after knight f5, he has bishop b5, he has not queen b5. And I'm gonna make a move. If we are... <laughs> chat! I'm at 40 seconds, and it's just move 13. I mean, the position is complicated, what can I say? It's very, very complicated. <laughs> So he played 12 moves and he already saw 2 minutes out of his 3 he gets. Yeah, he won't set castles. That's what I was a bit concerned of. Okay, then I'll go rook a1, rook ac1 with b4, I guess, I suppose. I mean, I gotta continue the pressure. Because if I don't continue the pressure, he's simply a pawn up. And that's not great, you know. Okay, here we're thinking whether I should play knight e or fg5. I don't really see the difference. But since I like my knight on e4 a tiny bit more than my knight on f3, I'll play knight fg5. Uh, oops, that loses a bishop. I don't want that. Okay. Chad, I don't think I really got anything. I'm just a pawn down now. <laughs> uh, yeah, maybe this was better to keep the pressure on the pawn. Or simply bishop 3 was better, perhaps. 
time. Oh dear, I had knight c5, bishop b5, rook c6, maybe. He doesn't have queen d1. No. Ah, but I lose my knight, but I don't lose my knight. Um, oh dear. Oh dear. Time. Sticking. get something right I'm getting mate in the middle of the board <laughs> okay what a mad game I might say <laughs> what a crazy game that was uh, yeah I mean it's surely again not the best game I played but it was interesting <laughs> it was good content I guess I hope eighty seven okay it wasn't actually that bad let me see D4 best move, chat. Ooh. Bishop E6 was a mistake. I should have played queen A4 immediately. Ah, why? Okay, if he simply plays like this. Ah, and I take the pawn. So I let him castle, but I take the pawn and ruin his pawn structure. Okay, makes sense. And if he protects the pawn, then he's... Not going to be able to castle. The queen for bishop d2. Bishop c3. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate And you give to give it a team. What's up to the Snoopy Dog? Uh, yeah, the coloring. Yeah, yeah, I was drawing. Mm, yeah, knight g5 was a blunder. Yeah, I should play bishop uh, c3. And what do I do if I play. Ooh, not f6. If you place knight. Uh, uh, what if you place knight e. My god, why am I seeing knight f6? It's pawn f6. Uh, I simply trade and look, his pieces are dead. If bishop e7, I get like rook d7, an insane play. But okay, I played this, knight h6, I get slightly worse position, but then I found rook d1, which was good. Take, take, and I'm actually winning here. Uh, and I won. I mean, I wouldn't say I'm plus 5 after bishop b 5 Ah, you play a4. Okay, yes, now I would say I'm plus 5. I was thinking about some like, I don't know, knight e4. Uh, but then queen d5, and then yeah, it's not that great. But after a4, of course, a4, uh, hold on. This is completely winning. Yeah, okay. Uh, so chat, let me open the break timer already. So it was an interesting game. But okay, it's it's nice that I found I found out with... Uh, I came up with the D4 move during the game. It's quite a nice move. Sure, I may have not played the best. But it was also fun seeing how we had a minute left at the 12 moves. <laughs> so, so for two minutes, for literally like five moves. <laughs> Since we blitzed out... Everything until bishop e6, so that's knight f3, c4, knight e3, g3, this. We blitzed out 8 moves, and then we saw for 2 minutes for 4 moves, chat. <laughs> In a blitz game. Yes, okay, so knight f3, right? c4, no, my goodness, wait. Here, knight f3, c4, knight e3, g3, bishop g2, castle e3, d4. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much for 5 moves, we spent 2 minutes. <laughs> good, 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 good. Definitely, definitely not a time waste. There was all, uh, all the smart time management. You know what I mean? Ah <laughs> uh, yes. You should be a draw. Knight f7, h6. But what I can say is probably, probably. Ah no. Okay, black doesn't. White doesn't want to play. Bishop, uh, knight versus knight. Okay. This should be a win for black, but it's not so easy. Five should be easy, no? Ah! And I wouldn't say easy, but yeah, bishop b1, bishop a2, king e4, bishop a2, king e3, and it's a draw. Oh no, wait! We didn't so all of a sudden. Ah! Uh -huh. Yeah, he has two pawns. Oh, now it's a draw all of a sudden again. Black takes. I mean, you have to take. D6. Ah, that's the draw. King C3 is such a move. Yeah, nice move. So I should play D6, King B2, F6, King A2, F7, two queens you're winning. 
and d6 he need to f6 if take take yeah i don't know if it's win it's complicated win especially in time travel so it should be a draw this is the only game maybe i'm sorry 21 months at tier one appreciate it thank you so much how are you doing i see you again as well thank you thank you okay chat break time i am going on a break grab a snack or a drink and i'll catch you in about four to five minutes take care everybody i actually might refill water ah. no i don't drink less uh so yeah chat see you soon
Hello chat, I'm back still 50 seconds left. Thank you so, so much, Pokebra for 40 months at tier one. Pookie for a hundred bits and Crush Damage for 14 months at tier one. I appreciate it guys. Thank you, thank you. And we got a hype train, let's go! Level two, 33% of level two. I appreciate it guys. Thank you. 30 seconds left in uh, the break still. So how are you doing everybody? Hopefully you're doing well. Hopefully you are doing well. Okay, mm, chat, I'm giving you five seconds to write a message and I'm gonna put on emote only. Oh no, not the hype chest. No, 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 no. I'm not falling for that. Nah, -uh. nah, -uh, Twitch, you cannot trick me. Hype chests aren't so hype, you know? Hype chests aren't hype at all. They're just a chest. And they are not even a chest. Chests should have something more than one emote, you know? <laughs> how, how dare you call that a chest? I mean, at least three emotes. Oh, gosh, why did I say that? At least three emotes would be hype chest. Oh, that's a literal hype emote you get by Lorgan5 gifted subs to the community. Thank you so much. Thank you, Lorgan. Airport, Merrill's Roller, Bustin, and Bishop. Got them. Thank you so, so much. Lorgan, I appreciate it. And we completed level two of the hype train chat. Thank you. Um, actually, actually, do I believe it should be seven? Oh no, I think I believe it should be seven. I think I might be better after something like e4 or bishop e6. But I don't remember lines by heart, so I believe it should be seven. F5 isn't a great move at all. Okay, let's play Queen D then. Um, I may or may not have blundered the E5 pawn. Ah, I did not blunder at all, chat. No. -uh. He was too intimidated. He thought it was a trap. <laughs> Intimidation. Mm. Okay, we should have C5. The idea is knight to d3. Why not? I think it's a good move. Hmm. I mean, I can play knight d4, play knight g4. I can play like rook e8, I can play like knight c1, I can play like knight c5, I can play like knight b4, I can play like bishop c3, I have so many options. I think I'll go knight d4 for whatever reason I like that the most. I don't know. Knight d4 just like bishop c2. And I didn't really see much options, I don't know, knight c1, I like, I love my knight's combo, I love my minor piece combo. Uh, so I don't want to trade my knight for his terrible c1 bishop. Yes, I was thinking about this, well... Mm. I was thinking to give away my bishop here, which is knight. It's better than his c1 bishop for sure. And I was thinking this with knight is trade, you know? I mean, he may or may not blunder a queen, you know? And if he plays like queen e1, I'll play like rook e8. That's the idea. And queen e1, maybe I can even play knight g2, if I want some content for you all. Since we got level 3 hype train, there sure will be some content, chat! So if queen d1, knight g2 is gonna happen. I am guaranteeing you that. If you play skin h2, f2 falls. If you play skin f1, knight g2 as well! Haha! <laughs> knight g2... Looks good. Yes, chat, I'm telling you, I'm content. I'm all for content. I live for content, you know. Content is my life. Okay, now 
do how do I convert the energy so, second secondary question Look like content, but I don't see how to win this is content. I suppose taken is a good move at least. And crash dummy a thousand bit, thank you so much, appreciate it. Thank you all guys for the hype train. That's already level four hype train. Thank you so much, chat. Appreciate it. Um, I mean about my position. Mm, let's not talk about my position, sh shall we? I'm not the biggest fan of it. Um, yeah, I'm not the biggest fan of it. Mm -hmm. Definitely not anymore. <laughs> I mean, I love it, like a bit, a bit before. Dear chat, I am actually scared for my dear life here. Uh, I mean, I shouldn't be. Hold on, I have queen g6. <laughs> I shouldn't be that scared. It's just a game, you know. I shouldn't be so scared for my dear life now. <laughs> the queens are getting traded off. Oh no, they aren't. Okay, maybe I should be scared for my dear life. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, what? No, that's a free bishop. That's a free bishop chat. I shouldn't be scared for my dear life anymore. I can ha live a happy life. Yay. Free bishop. Okay, let's lock in. Do, do. Bye-bye, knight. You won't be missed, at least for me. I won't miss you at all. And then I'm pinning his bishop to his rook. Uh, yeah, just h6, so there are no back ranks, and I should be chilling. Yum. Here. Yum. Boom! Free bishop. Okay, content paid off! Let's go! Definitely I wasn't lucky or anything. No, 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 no. It was all because I played knight g2. I definitely didn't almost have a heart attack after he played bishop g2 or rook h1. Nah, -uh. It was all because of knight g2. <laughs> no, but okay, knight g2 was probably a mistake if I'm being realistic. Um, I was a bit of before for sure. I think I gave the advantage away. And I gave him the advantage. But then he blundered. And I won. Fair trade for me. Okay, I found a brilliancy. Ooh. Okay, I actually wasn't better. I did brilliant. Chat content for a brilliant move. Let's go farming brilliancies like, like that. And uh, can you wonder was rookie an option? It was. It was. It was. Uh for sure. Yes, Stockfish just says. Yeah, that's a good uh, idea. I was actually considering it. Mm -hmm. Because the idea was, right, because if he takes, I simply play knight h3, and then, yeah, queen of two rook eight, if he survives this, then he's, he's, he's a god in chess, you know? Uh, but yes, if rook g3, I win a tempo, king g2, and I wasn't sure. Okay, Stockfish says I am forced to give away my knight, 
and then uh, force a draw. Oops, no, 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 go to scam it. I'm forced to force a draw. Queen h4, if queen f1, I get this check. Uh, if rook h3, or king f3, if check here or here. And if king g1, I get rook e1, and that's actually winning for me. So it was possible, but it was a draw with knight f2. But yeah, here was a little scare. Uh, not gonna lie. You're super conscript, but then I found this bishop of f queen g6, I equalized and he should blunt to bishop. So, I take these wins. <laughs> I mean, I actually thought it was much better after... <sighs> after the opening, when I played 92. I thought I gave away the advantage with 92. But apparently I wasn't. Yeah, chat, I, now I'm thinking I should have refilled the water. Because... I feel like, I don't know, one-fourth of the bottle left. HYPE CHEST! HYPE CHEST! CHAT! Are we hyped for the hype chest? Okay, just a stupid emote. I mean, give at least three! Three emotes for a chest! How? It's a hype chest! Give it a single emote! But still, it's a nice emote. But it should be three emotes! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but anyway, thank you so much guys for the support. 9 gifted subs and 1200 bits. Appreciate it. But Twitch is a scam. It shouldn't be a chest. I'm still mad about that game I lost because of a hype chest chat. I still remember it for the rest of my life. If I see hype chest. Okay. It should be just called hype emote. How is it a chest? I chat, I just don't know how can that be a chest. Like no way in the world you get a single emote as you got before from a chest. <laughs> like it's illogical. Maybe e5 was just better now. Probably. Because now he gets e8. But then he wouldn't. Okay, knight of one. I, 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 I truly have no idea what you are supposed to play here, right? I mean, I just know you play h4 and pray. Uh, I mean, maybe you don't need to pray if you know how to play. But since I don't know how to play, I'm gonna just simply pray that uh, I will find the good moves. But okay, I mean, right now the idea looks interesting with my range to knight e4. Mm, I'll try. Boom. Okay, queen d2. I mean, it looks interesting, not gonna lie. I mean, I don't mind this position. It looks with some perspective. Uh, no, it looks with some initiative. Now my biggest fear is just to think for 20 minutes and be low on time. Which I like to do sometimes. Okay, let's get my rook over <laughs> here. Okay, I'm not sure what a4 is doing. Uh... I just want to mate him, you know. <laughs> My goal is clear. Bam, checkmate. Let's see if I can do it. <laughs> Let's see if I can accomplish my goal. Uh, doesn't this simply win? Doesn't it? It looks like it does. Okay. okay. It looks good, chat. What can I say? I mean, if I win this without knowing, I was just knowing like basic plans how to play. And if I win like 30 moves, I mean, I won't complain about that win. <laughs> and I like the fact that my opponent is thinking for one and a half minutes. So, yeah, that's probably his best try to just hack an exchange. That's good news. I mean, the idea is I may even play queen f4. <laughs> Not even take the exchange. <laughs> it would be like really uh, nasty. I'm not sure if that's gonna be great. Hmm. Let me think, Chad. Let me think. Maybe you can cook something up. No, but everything looks winning! Rook h7! Kevin f4! 97! Anything! 
that's, that's, that sometimes can be actually a problem <laughs> when you have so too many win moves. So you don't know what to choose. <laughs> but that's a, a first world problem, you know? First world problem. Okay, I think I'm simply gonna take and take and take and take and take. <laughs> take and take and take. The position looks pretty good. I might not win in 30 moves, but at least get a good position in 30 moves. Rook g7. Ah, tricky guy! Tricky, tricky. Rook g7, king of 8. Bye bye to my rook. Ah, ah. Tricky, tricky. Tricky, tricky. Okay, rook e1. Okay. Uh, here. Rook to is queen h6. Ooh, chat, look at this. Boom. King of h, rook g7. Rook g7, queen h8, rook g8, queen h8. Boom. Oh! Oh, what a game! Ooh, chat, what a game that is! Oh my god, that's the best game by far in the tournament. That's the best game by far. By a mile. Hold on. Now I'm even thinking of, I don't want to take his rook. This? Uh, I mean, I can take this, this is mate. I think rook e7, queen e6. Ah, maybe that's actually not making. Ah, maybe I shouldn't be cooking, just take the rook, you know. I still think rook e7, completely, I mean, it's of course completely winning there. But I just don't see him mate. Chad, that was such a W game! <laughs> I had no idea, he was too slow. He did absolutely nothing on the queen side, he just played a4 without even trying anything. And I just made it him meanwhile, you know? <laughs> win win for me. It's a win for me. Here's one thing. <laughs> Maybe. Ah! If everybody got it, then here. Oh, brilliant C! Let's go! No, I was afraid that you'd be Catalan. He didn't go for Catalan, respect for that. Yeah, he was too slow. I mean, I just got bishop g5. I just knew you play bishop g5 ag, and then play some after that. And then this. And then he just made so many wasteful moves. Like rook eight, at least try queen eight immediately. I enjoy, yeah, it's not that clear. I mean, is it? Isn't it? Oh, no, it isn't. Because he has 98. Uh huh. So king g1, queen eight, and knight f6. Yeah, rook eight was a big mistake because now knight doesn't have 98, you know? Uh, and a knight of six. Okay, if GF he just can't escape. No. Uh, so king of eight. Oh yeah. Okay. Stock versus this is this. Queen before. Yeah, I thought about. I actually thought about queen before, but for whatever reason I didn't find bishop of three, bishop e eight. I don't know how. I didn't. That's completely winning. But I mean, okay. What I did in the game was totally win as well. Rook eight seven. And then queen eight six, rook g seven, queen eight eight. Another nasty combination. Nice game chat. That's the best game of the tournament so far. I mean, I don't mind playing better games than that, you know. I surely don't mind. But that was so good. Very good. That looks better. And on the clock and on the position. 9 of 6 where? What do you mean, Empire Rage? Where do you mean knight of six? Yes, this looks like a win for white. Oh, a4. Oh, that's so nasty. P8 wins his recheck. Oh, just push a5. Just push a5. Just push. Wow, what a precise play from white. Mamma mia. That's so precise. <laughs> Insanely precise from white. Okay, bishop knight mate. Ah, yeah, knight f6 was a great move. But still. No, but yeah, rook 8 was a mistake. Because. Ah, you were guessing. Okay, 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 okay. But yeah. 
If you wouldn't play rook e8 and play queen e8 immediately, I would play queen f4, but then you get knight e5. Because the idea, knight f6, gf, nay, 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 knight f6, knight f6, gf, bishop f3, queen g5, knight e8. Ah, I have nothing. I'm just either a piece or even two pieces down. But rook e8 was just a bad move. The knight should be on d7 or c7. It shouldn't. No, 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 on d7 or on c5. I mean, I think. Can we also, ah, that's not much. Might still has a million moves. Okay, knight e7 would be a great move, you know. Knight e7 would be an absolute brilliancy. Karma, do you like knight e7? Knight e7 or knight b6, Karma? Which one do you like more? Ah! <laughs> oh my god! I mean, that's a brilliant season here, Chad. What a brilliant move. Knight f6 pales in comparison. My knight f6 just pales in comparison to this knight e7. <laughs> I mean, if that isn't a brilliancy, I don't know what is. <laughs> Karmar, is that a, an, an, a, a BM norm? I think it must. It must be. So chat, if you can't mate with knight and bishop, don't worry, I said you 100 GM can either. <laughs> we saw that on the clock actually. In like 15 seconds. I think he did, and then he... he, he but he remembered how to stalemate pattern. <laughs> okay, Karma. basically, there was an endgame. Measure of knight versus skin. And the guy still beat his bishop and knight. He forgot how to mate, and he still made it, and he was 3100 GM. So that should be a norm, shouldn't it? Call the green guys, Karma. Call the green guys. Call the green guys! I'm, I'm actually surprised why I got a 2468 in round 5. Was I the lowest? The highest, lowest uh, four pointer or what? Rook F2! No! Rook F2 would be a draw somehow. I don't know. You can check me. Instead of a draw, you lose. I mean, it's live. Stuff happens. Not a GM. Sad. I wanted to play a GM! But I got an I am. I mean, I don't. No, nah, it doesn't matter that he's 3000. I just want to take GM. Okay, let's crash this guy to get a GM in the next round. But no, he just will probably get paired against an FM. <laughs> Maybe. Gotta hope, you know. Oh dear, what is this line? Uh, D4 and then H4. That's something new. <laughs> I've never seen this in my, I don't know, a year I played Cosio. In my whole year I haven't seen this line played. But he's thinking, maybe he isn't sure how to play. Maybe he knows, I don't know. Why am I yapping so much? I don't know, okay, queen of 6 he simply plays bishop e3, which is unpleasant. So what should I play? Bishop g5 looks actually pretty interesting, I don't know why. his bishop. Dun, dun, dun. Oh dear. So he voluntarily uh, doesn't want to castle. Oh, okay. Tough. Tough, tough, tough. I don't know. I mean, it looks. It, it looks. It doesn't look simple, the position, for sure. But I mean, it's bleed, so you cannot really think much, unfortunately. Even though I would love to think in this position. I don't know if castle in short state is, is going to be a, a self-made or, or a self-win. Because, I mean, I, I'm literally walking into his H-pawn. And G-pawn. Oh, chat! I, I, chat, should I get concerned? No, no. Was the castle a mistake? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, it looks tiny bit concerning. Just tiny bit. Just so tiny, you can even, you barely see the concern, you know? Maybe G6 isn't the best move either. 
It's uh, no, no concern at all. I'm not worried. He's worried, Chad. He gets F5. Oh, God. What is this? <laughs> Why is this position so mad? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> what is this? First time there was a D for H4. Now he gets... He has positive... He, <laughs> this is madness. Okay, B4. I want to play F6, I guess. Or maybe D5. Bishop F5. No idea. Okay, maybe d5, bishop f5, because I kinda wanna move my bishop. And if I move my bishop to f5, g6 isn't as weak anymore. So I win win, if you ask me. <laughs> this is so mad. Okay, bishop f5, maybe you'll blunder in exchange. I doubt that there's 3000 with blunder in exchange, but you never know, you gotta stay positive, right? Um. Yeah. Oh. Ah, c5, g4 is so tempting. Chad, I'm going for it. I don't care. Sacrificing the pawn. He didn't blunder the exchange. But I'm sacrificing the pawn. And the reason why I'm sacrificing the pawn is... I don't know. I'm, I'm tired of being passive. I want to do something. <laughs> That's why I'm sacrificing the pawn. Uh, okay. King d2 is actually an interesting move. I mean, I suppose rook c8 is okay. Because I don't worry. I am not worried if he takes c5. Mm -hmm. I can take c5, I don't mind. I'm thinking whether I should fix the pawn structure with c4. I mean, I actually like it. c3 ideas in the air. I like it, I like it. And I didn't even need to sacrifice a pawn. Uh oh, I'm, I no. I mean, you didn't have to do that. But okay, the, I can take with the f pawn and I play like rook f seven. I think. Okay. Uh, now he's threat. I mean, he's not really threatening, but he wants to take my pawn. So, and I don't want to sacrifice it. So, do I sacrifice it? It's, I mean, it's interesting for sure. Hmm, hmm. How tempted am I to sacrifice it? Not much. It's tempting a bit. But maybe bishop b6. Solid. But bishop mm, bishop b6 I'm allowing like rook c2 and stuff. So I'm thinking bishop b3 is better actually. Bishop b3, queen g4, like rook f5 maybe. I don't know. But bishop d3 is the move I think. And rook f5, bishop b4 perhaps. May helps. Okay. Uh, yeah, rook f5. I don't want to let him play queen e6. That's the sole reason, the sole purpose behind rook f5. The good thing is that he cannot really do much against my d3 bishop since the knight is stuck, and if he plays knight c5, I simply take d4. Bah -bah. Um, Maybe I should play bishop b4. But then you play queen e2, likely. Yeah. Um. Hmm. <laughs> okay, come back. I'm back. Come back, come back, come back. Okay, now what do I do? Time isn't. Time is ticking, unfortunately. I mean, what if I fade and move? Oh, like Queen of Fate, actually. Ah, no, 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 Queen of Fate, no, no, no. I'd, I'd pass, thank you. What do you offer? I'd pass. I didn't see how to win. Okay, it doesn't want to draw as well. I gotta hurry. Bishop here is so good, it's preventing rook h1 actually. <laughs> and I wanna play queen c8. The only issue is the clock. Add bishop g5, rook f3. What am I doing? I threw so hard. Oh no.
no time. Okay. Oh God, do you play? Oh! Okay, this was a mad game. But I feel like I deserve to win more than he deserved to. I was putting pressure for the whole game. So it would be unfortunate if I would lose on the time. Yes! Now it should be AGM, surely, Chesscom, right? <laughs> what should we get in FM chat? <laughs> mm. Mm. Ah! I mean, there is one FM and six. There is two FMs on six. Chat, I feel like there is. Yeah, I feel like I'll get an FM. I don't know why, but I have this feeling. Okay, this game was mad. Uh, so yeah, he was better. Then I was like winning. Then I didn't know how to win. Yeah, Bishop d5 simply. Bishop d5 would win. I wasted tempo. Then he got this knight c5. Then he was better. Then it was equal. But then I got this rook c3, queen c3, bishop c2, trade the queens. G5, king of 7, yeah, king of 7, I, I thought I would play it here, but then G6, E6, he has a bazillion pawns. Or actually, the drawing move is E6, maybe. Yeah, the winning move is E6. So, king of 7 blocking his pawns, pushing my pawn, taking this, taking B pawn, and I'm promoting the A pawn. Let's go! Okay, chat, your predictions. Will I get an FM, an IM, or a DM? I don't know. We'll see. Do, 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 do. Two, 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 two. You didn't see the green yet for a long time. Ay, ay, ay. Were they on a long vacation or no? Careful with the move, but it's difficult to find and calculate. But and then trouble. But yeah, I think White's playing for a draw, so they they are fine with the draw. That's why they took on d4. <coughs> they king of three. Eh? Okay, that's good. King of two. Ah, okay. Bishop d7. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. King of two. King of two. Come on. Okay, with that play, I have a feeling Black actually might grind this out. I mean, no, they can't really. No, don't let Kindy, Kindy too. Okay, now Black will win this chat. I'm calling it. Black is gonna win this game. Bishop d1? No, c a. It's a difficult steal. But I feel, I feel in Black is a more comfortable position to play. Bishop d1. Bishop f yeah. Should be a draw. Okay. White found a way to draw, actually, it seems like. Do 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 Bishop D seven King D one Okay now it's winning. Black over pushed. But how do you win is a question. I mean Bishop C six Bishop B five is the move I suppose. Ah the 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 the, the, the pawn is uncatchable. Ah! I just played Bishop B five because I said draw Ah Unfortunate Yeah so Bishop B five C three Bishop D three was the idea. Uh, but Black missed it, and now it's a draw. But how does Black draw? It's another question. Many, many questions in this game has to be have to be answered. And not sure if Black will answer this question actually. Okay, they will. Or maybe they won't. I know they won't actually. <laughs> That's why just sometimes you don't have to over push. Black just ha wanted to go all in for a win, and they ended up losing. I mean, it happens. But yeah. That's why over pushing is sometimes tiny bit risky, especially in time trouble. You know. Black had to draw like a million moves in a row. But they were pushed. And they lost. 
I mean, they still didn't lose yet, right? Me blunder, of course. But it looks very likely that they will lose. Mm, maybe I spoke too soon. Between this <laughs> jump drop, it's so tricky. Yes, king is seven, king is six. Voila, no, king is six. Come on, king is six, queen is six. Queen, no, no, yes, voila, boom. Oh dear. Okay, chat. I think uh, it's a draw. Queen H8 was drawing. So we go Queen H8, King F5, Queen H5, King H8, Queen H8, King H6, Queen B8. It's a draw. Oh my god. That white black missed it. Ooh. Wow. That's what time trouble does to people. <laughs> hmm. And yes. Chat, will this game be 200 moves? No, it won't. 188. What a game! What a game! To watch and imagine how it felt to play it. Crazy. Okay. Okay, chat. Content again. Today is a contentful day. Let's see. What I can do. Five an interesting move. Maybe very interesting. Or should I play b3, making him play d5 and then knight b5? Uh, does the uh, inclusion of the move matter? I don't think it does. I gotta make a move. <clears throat> also, knight b5. Should be three if Ruby two and play Ruby one. Okay, here. Uh huh. All right, maybe Bishop D two then, like Rook C one maybe, and Rook C two. Rook C1 here Okay Bishop E3 looks like a fine move <clears throat> Okay Mm -hmm. I can play d4, but then if he takes uh, the d pawn, will be a passer. Mm -hmm. Mm 
Okay. Rupee seven. Do we play? <clears throat> mm -hmm. Okay, that's sacrificing a pawn. He doesn't take it. Uh, now I'll go here. King d6, bishop b8, rook d7, rook b7, rook c2, a3, 4 a3, and game as it seems is likely. <clears throat> Take a say G7 hangs. This. I mean, I can't really defend it, so I guess H4. Here. Oh, I blundered. Uh, yeah, sure, like King G3 would be a draw. No, King G3 or something. Mm. <sighs> it was close, it was close, chat. Yeah, I should have played King G3. Yeah, something like this. Yeah, bishop e7, I completely blunt bishop f6. Maybe stalemate? King f2, h2? No, okay. King g3? No. Okay. Yeah, chat, that was close. That was very close, but unfortunately not quite enough. Not quite enough for the draw. Mm. Yeah, instead of bishop g5, king g3, I think simply drew. And king g3 has nothing. Mm. Yeah. 
yeah, simply or F3 or I think in G3 even drew. Okay, maybe it's not like draw. It should be though. Oh no, okay, what's losing this Lauren? Yeah, okay. So I should have found F3 here. F3 is freaking, I find it's a draw. Yeah, break now, but I don't think it's break yet. I can still analyze for a bit. Ah, uh, but review. Yeah, okay, I got slightly worse here. He was winning. Oh, okay, rook e3, fe, bishop g3, and game is winning. Okay, that's a bit crazy. Um, anyway, what's the draw then, Glenn? Unfortunately. I don't know. I thought bishop endgame should be easier to hold. I hate rook endgames. <laughs> because, <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. Probably was, actually. But okay. Still a pretty decent game. Unfortunate blunder at the end, though. Okay. Okay, this game ended in a draw. And this game is still going. And this will probably go for a while, actually. Since uh, probably as yeah, a pawn is gonna get taken, and invite will try to win this for 10 years. But it should be a draw, of course, with perfect play, but as we all know, Rook and Bishop is very tricky. Rook and Bishop versus Rook is very tricky in time trouble. I managed to lose Rook, Bishop versus Rook, but here there is an extra Rook, so it's very complicated. I was close, I was close. Yeah, Bishop d5 was a terrible blunder. f3, e3, king f3, king f1, king f4, king e2, king g3, Bishop d5, it's a draw. I was like, ah, Bishop c3 was there! But yeah, f3 I had to be found, which is tricky. e3, king f3, I had to calculate that bishop f6, I'm fine, king f4, king e2, bishop, king g3, bishop g5, I go back and forth and I'm fine, I think. Maybe I'm not. Because he gets bishop g6, bishop. It's a complicated position. Such a complicated position. Because he gets king g3, king e4, bishop h4. Is that a draw? Or maybe it should have been a draw, actually. I actually had to take the e pawn. And sack my bishop for the the g pawn, and it would be a draw. Okay, two. Ah, okay. Complicated, complicated end game. But I played well, quite well, I think. Rook two, rook two, rook two. No, no, rook two is a draw. It's a draw. Okay, chat. Break time. I can finally get more water so I can drink without uh, without saving it. So that I'll have enough. Chat, it's break time. I will see you in a couple of minutes. Grab a grab, we will grab a drink or a snack and see you all soon.
Oh, what a chat! I can drink finally! Because the last two rounds, I barely could drink anything. Because there was no water left, pretty much. And I had to be saving it up. Yeah, maybe actually keeping the rooks was better. I don't know. I thought bishop and game would be easy at all. Uh, but it wasn't. <laughs> Yeah, rook b4. It's still tricky in time trouble to hold it. But it was more holdable. Oh, I think I didn't spill much. Okay, Imor on the chat. Every time in time back. Nice, nice, nice. Get on started. Okay, chat. Black pieces. Today, actually, I, didn't, I don't think I got double white or double black. If I recall correctly. Cozio chat? We're getting Cozio. How many times did I play Cozio today already? <laughs> I actually f you forgot. First round, seventh round, ninth round, and maybe I actually had one before. I don't know. But it's definitely at least three times that I had Cozio today. Oh, and then also this brilliant 92. Four times! Four times I've had Cozio! Look, uh, this, this game, this game, this, I don't remember what was that. Was it Cozio? Was it not Cozio? I don't know. Oh, C4, oh dear. Uh. Wait, is Queen G4 the move? Hold on. <laughs> Wait, Queen G4 might be the move here, actually. <laughs> remember that was a weird move in some of the lines. I did here. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> no, but actually, jokes aside, I think it is. Queen d4, knight d4, bishop d1. Boom, boom. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, chat. If I lose my queen, I lose my queen. I don't care. Content! <laughs> uh, I know, the other game, my opponent plays 1b3, so it's 4 quarters here so far. Maybe we can make it 5. I think. Queen d4 is a good move here. As I remember, there I uh, seen some goofy line. But yes, okay, queen c4, d5. I'm a piece down, literally. I cannot do anything. Okay. Boom. I don't do a castle. I think I do. Uh -huh. It's a goofy line. But it's all for content, you know. If I win, do not. It doesn't matter. At least it's a fun to play and make my GM opponent think for half of his time on move for thirteen moves, even less because he blitzed out first eight moves. So I made him think one and a half minutes for five moves. <laughs> it's recurring, recurring situation today actually. Once I was with White and my opponent thought so much. I mean, we both thought there, but here. Uh, so far, it's been just my opponent, but of course, it can change any second. Maybe knight d3, bishop d6 was slightly more precise, but okay, now I want to play bishop d6. Mm -hmm. Surely we'll play this if bishop before rook knight d3. This will go rook a8. Rook a8, e8, not a8. It should be bishop b5. Or did it lose my piece after f4? Oops. Chat, I may have. Lost a piece. Um, 
Okay, chat, you didn't find me losing a piece. Let's go. <laughs> I was so concerned about F4, G4, F5. I mean, he was thinking for a while, so he probably saw it, but he didn't see, he saw something I didn't see, how I saved my piece. But I was so concerned you'd find it. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, 92, I think. It's a fine move. I don't want to take B2, giving him another open file. Mm -hmm. He took that pawn. I thought he wouldn't. I thought he'd be scared, but he isn't scared. I don't know why. He should be. G6. G6, G4. No, G6 is this. Is, is, is. Boom. Boom. Uh -huh. And G6, 95 is there as well. Okay, I gotta hurry. He's in time trouble. So making quicker moves would be a good, a good idea, I think. I'll make it. Anyways, uh, I can be it. G6. Does it take? Don't know. What do I play? Should have been rookie five, rookie five. Not lose anything. It was such a good position. It was such a good position. No! Second game in Royce was such a perfect position. Oh, it's such a pity. Ah. Yeah, I think I was even better. Maybe he blunders through his six. No, he doesn't. Oh, so unfortunate. So unfortunate. Or B5. B5 this PC check. Ah chat. Um, that was um, such a pity. It was such a great position out of the cause you had like two minutes versus twenty seconds and I lost it. No. Okay, I should have taken C4. Ah, not C4, G4 I mean. Knight C4 rook F1. I took G4, F6, G3, A6, and that happened. I should play something like rookie six, I'd be fine. I think. Get triple pawns, literally. Oh no, why am I stupid? Yeah, here, just play like rookie six. Pawn down, but it's better than this. Yes, triple pawns. Yeah, here was equal. Even here was equal. I had rookie one, check. And if king of two. Ah, tactics! And 93, 92. Draw. Yeah, and if he goes king h2, then something like rookie five, I'm fine. Yeah, it was a good game. I got a good position towards the opening. Here is slightly better. G5. Yeah, but okay, G5, Bishop, G3. What's the difference between this and what happened in the game? 
1894. Ah, and he doesn't have rook f1, since e8 is protected. And I go knight e3 and g4. Yeah, makes sense. This I protect and I go knight e3 and g4, or rook d4, rook d4. Yeah. Yeah, because when I played rook d4, e8 rook was hanging in so many, un un many variations, which was really, really unpleasant and uncomfortable, you know? Because if e8 rook wouldn't hang, I would have knight e3. Like in that variation. But in the game, I couldn't play knight e3 because rook e2 and my, my rook is weak. So, yeah. But okay, chat, that was a pretty decent game. Against a GM. He had two 20 seconds while I had two minutes. I mean, that's good, isn't it? I mean, better would be if I'd have 20 seconds versus two minutes and I managed to win. Yeah, but at least made him sink. You know, it's all because of Cosio. <laughs> He dedicated that loss to Cosio. <laughs> I mean, it's un I, I think it's quite uncommon that people dedicate loss to something. But I dedicate that co loss to Cosio. <laughs> uh, yeah. <clears throat> Sorry, Cosio. But I dedicated something to you. And that's a win, unfortunately, but a loss. But you should be fine. Okay. I want to play. How much will this last for? Oh, it was Cosio! Cha 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 cha! It was Cosio! Yes! Yes! I'm popularizing Cosio chat! Let's go! Chat, I'm popularizing Cosio so much! Like, the Cosio in this game. Real black flag? <laughs> Maybe. Okay, chat, this is like two more moves. Okay, it was this move. Let's go! Two more two more rounds, chat. Let's go! Cool. <laughs> I wanna find more brilliant moves. Okay, black. Double black. Fifth Scozio. Come on! I know you can play E4. I know you love E4. I know you will play E4. Come on! <gasps> chat, 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 chat. Chat? Chat, 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 chat. Are you kidding me? That's the drawest line in the world! You must have played Cosio! <laughs> you are not following the script, my guy! No! You should have played Cosio! Oh dear. Okay, I think B5 is an actually interesting move to gain space. Possible. I'll go for it. Co 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 content without co 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 zero. Co 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 content without co 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 zero. I don't know. That's such a stupid song, but I mean, I don't know. I'm hyped to 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 punish him for the thing co zero. That's that's my goal is. Punish people who don't play Spanish. Not even Cosio, because I'm the one choosing whether you play Cosio or not. But I'm I want to punish people who don't play Roy Lopez. Okay. <sighs> That's what I didn't want him to find. But still, anyways, I think I'm getting a point. If you take c6, I'm fine. Oh dear, okay. Uh huh. Uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, that's a nice move which I missed. Unpleasant, unpleasant. Pretty unpleasant.
Check the pawn. <gasps> Look at four. No, 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 no. Sneaky little guy. Okay, I have g6, g4, queen, g5. I don't know. Maybe I should just give away the pawn. Yeah, okay. Take that pawn. I don't care about it. I'll play rook c8. And get your c2 pawn. C trade. C trade podcast. <laughs> Okay, rook a c8 I think is best. Because if rook f c8 then he explains it and I'm lost. Or I'm not lost but I have to go to the same game being a pawn down. Ah, sneaky guy! Oh my goodness! If I play bishop c2, he goes queen c8! Ah, he's a tactic beast! Lord, okay, h6. Okay. I still want to give you what you deserve for not playing Rui Lopez. So let's lock in chat. I am now bishop c2 is an idea because I have h7, of course. Of course. Come on, it's good that you're thinking. If you're thinking, you're evaluating the position. If you're evaluating the position, uh, you have less time. <laughs> you have less time, I have no chance to win. A worse position. So, go ahead and think more. <laughs> okay, bishop c2, I suppose, is needed. I don't want to play two pawns down. Yeah, this guy is super tricky, oh my goodness. Like, he's so tricky. I thought I am tricky, but no, I'm not. <laughs> Compared to this guy, I am not tricky at all. Dang, I don't win a pawn even. <laughs> so I'll be a pawn down, I said. You're telling me I'll be a pawn down? No. I refuse to believe that. I absolutely refuse to believe it. Okay, I'll play b3. What will you do on that, huh? I wanna play rook b2, queen d4, queen d1, queen b4, queen b3. Mm -hmm. You'll play probably play queen b4 and I'll be the one who's thinking. <laughs> okay, chat, look at this. Queen b3, queen e1. Resigns. How is this guy not planted in anything? Okay, wait, maybe he blundered. This. This. Oh dear, <laughs> his skin is walking. It needs to breathe some fresh air. Needs to breathe some fresh air. I mean, I can help make it even fresher if he wants to. I can mate him there. H7, I mean, surely. My rook! Yes! I tricked the trickster! Let's go! <laughs> no, but this guy was extremely, extremely tricky. But I tricked him at the end! <laughs> mm. Mm. I actually blundered my rook, if I'm gonna be honest. I should have played rook h1. I think rook h1 would be better. Uh, but win is a win. Yeah, can you show me some blunder? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my gosh, guys, look here. Ah, it's not that beautiful. No, but I saw this, this. 
I suck my queen. And then rook f6. But I simply have rook f6 immediately. Yes, I learned rook h1 was winning. King h7, he had rook d7, I think. Ah, no, okay. Rook d7 actually loses to fg or rook h1. But he had rook 4 d3 and he's equal. Go here, he cannot take because my. Okay, yeah, it made things more complicated. Without me. Uh, without, uh, without it requiring it to get tricky. Okay, here, yeah, he was better, but he messed it up a bit. I got, and I got tricky. Because he had low, he had a uh, little time on the clock, I had to get tricky with his b3, queen e5, so he cannot take, rook c1, his king went for a walk, then this, 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 and in case he wants a blunder, I should play rook h1, but I managed to win, so I don't care if it's a blunder or not. <laughs> for me, th the most important thing is the, uh, the, 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 the quality of the game. The most important thing is the result. <laughs> You can have a perfect quality of play and a blunder in one move. Or you can play terribly and beat and loss. And then win because you open blunders in one move. <laughs> you know what I mean? So if somebody would ask me, hey, would you like to be, uh, to have great quality or result? I would rather get result in like 99% of the cases. Because the result is what you're playing for. That's what I would do. <laughs> so I don't mind if I, did, if I play this game terribly. I won! So that's the thing that matters, you know? I could have played the game perfectly like I did uh, in previous round. And I blunder instead of drawing with like extra one and a half minutes. I lost! And here was terrible! But I won! So I, I'd rather that. Anytime. <laughs> doo doo doo. Mm. Yeah. I mean, this is tricky not only to draw but to win as well. Because I always know how to win this. Yeah, but now you have to go king b1, which is unpleasant to find. Oh, mating two! Okay. So it was easy to, easy to win at the end of the day. Okay, this game will last for like 10 years. Oh no! It was a threefold! Okay. Okay, chat. So, my prediction was wrong, fortunately. Because this game could very well last for another 60 minutes. Okay, chat! Right in the last round. Let's go. Usually you get this position with a good bishop on g5 putting pressure. That's tiny bit, tiny downgrade, you know, from from more uh, I could get. But okay, it's fine. Because usually there is a knight on f6 instead of in e7 and bishop on e7, and I have a bishop on g5. A bishop on g5 may put some pressure. But okay, I'll find a way how to put pressure without the bishop. I hope. I hope I'll find out how to do it. I like rook d1, d5 maybe. Or rook c1, rook d1. Maybe rook fd1, because I, I surely want my rooks on c1 and d1. So, mayhaps rook fd1 is the better move order to start with. Yeah, I think so. Because I surely do not want to play. Because I want to have d5 in in, this, uh, in the air so that he may be concerned. Or he literally doesn't care and he won't be concerned at all. All depends on him. <laughs> okay, I'll play queen c2. I have bishop b7, I'll go d5. Take, 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 take. And try to grind out this endgame. Pretty much. Oh, and i5. If he doesn't take, I get bishop f3, I'll be fine. Uh, if this, I think I should take. No, I mean, of course, I will take. And maybe 94, but then he gets 95, so mm, yeah, this is gonna be a little tricky to win, but I tricked the trickster in the last game, so uh, yeah, let's hope for the best. Because you know, he may blunder in one move, like blunder and I just have seen. In Blitz, anything can happen. 
And since it's time is getting lower and lower, time travel is new and, and in time travel even more crazy wild things might happen. Okay, I'll play Queen B3. I don't know, maybe I should stop talking <laughs> a bit because I I am very, very active today. I don't know why I'm talking so much. But okay. I guess you don't mind because it's content. Talking is content. Queen B is actually looks like a really good move. <laughs> yeah, that looks very really nice. What if I get my knight to c5? Because on e5 it's currently not doing very much. Maybe on c5 I can do more. Yeah, but queen b is such a nice move from my opponent. With the idea of rook fc8, protecting b5 pawns. Yeah, very nice, very, very good move. Love it. Yeah, I'm thinking whether I should play queen d6 or queen c5. Queen d6 runs to knight e4 perhaps, so probably I'll play queen c5. And if queen c5, I guess I have to take dc because otherwise I lose the pawn. And dc is not what I really wanted to do. Okay, he doesn't even take. Okay, then maybe I can play queen d6. And knight d4, queen d4 is there. Yeah, sure, queen d6. I'd like, I'd like to, I'd love to play it previ in previous move, but if I can now, I'll do it. Why not? Because now I just want to play d5, and I think I'll be happy if I get, if I get rid of this isolated pawn, I'll be extremely, extremely happy in the end game. And if he plays knight f6 now, maybe I have some slight knight e5, putting pressure on the knight on the c6 square. Okay, this. Here I was actually thinking rook c7, so if he takes d6, rook c8, and if this queen is, if rook c7, I go queen e7, I was thinking. I'm ready for material imbalances. Okay, queen e7, knight f6, knight queen e8. Queen e8, check. Queen B8 is a good move. Oh dear. Okay. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. I mean, I can take Queen F7, of course, I think. He has King H7, though. So maybe I cannot do that. Uh huh. Then let's move my knight to like I don't know g3 or c3, maybe c3, so that his rook cannot do anything. On that line, okay. Now I'll stop talking. I'm gonna concentrate. God. No, what a brilliant trap by my opponent. 
No! Queen of Four, that's so nasty. Oh! Yeah, well done from him. Ah, such an unfortunate loss. Such a brilliant trick. Oh, no! Yeah, that's really unfortunate. At this point, it's just... Uh, but yeah, credit to him for finding it. Hold on, chat! Chat, it's not over till it's over. It's over. No, no, no. It's not over till it's over. <laughs> Such a good job. Okay, can I flag him? Can I flag him? Chat, can I flag him? No, I don't think I can. Ah, I thought it was such a nice... Yeah. I think I played well, but yes, it's queen of four. It's a brilliant team. Ah, yeah, seven. Terrible end to the tournament, honestly. I was on six out of... No, I was on six out of seven. And it was seven out of eleven. I lost three games. Out of four. <sighs> yeah. Unfortunate. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but Queen of Four I completely missed it. Yeah, but first he found this 94. And then Queen of Four. He's very good with the knight. And something like, if I ever would have played h3, it would actually save me the game. <laughs> yeah, okay, it was equal here. Then I landed the pawn. It was 94. I only move was d5. Then this is this. And a queen of four, brilliancy. And I had nothing. I mean, okay, I had something. I had something when I took on g7, I thought. But unfortunately, I didn't have anything that big to, to do anything, to create any chances. Yeah, unfortunate ending to the tournament, but my opponent played well. Um, yeah, probably I did something not so well in the opening. Yeah, 94 was better. This is an isolated pawn. Lost me the game pretty much. Yeah, but okay, d4 here is 9 of 6. And this, yeah, would be equal. But at this point, a draw would be better than loss, of course. Oh well, nothing you can do about it. Mm. Yeah, so let's see. The tournament started out on a, I mean, shaky game, but I didn't play for a while, so I was fine in Kozio. Then I lost a terrible game, but well played from my opponent. Then I won. Then I won a brilliant game with some nice novelty I found during the game. Then I won a brilliant game in Kozio. I mean, it wasn't brilliant, but it was content. Then this was the best game of the tournament by far. This was shaky, but I won. Here was equal by a loss. Here was equal by a blunder, and then I lost. This was a good game as well. And this wasn't a good game. <laughs> Thank you so much, Anis Gifter, for giving me a What's up to Backstream? So I got 80s. Okay, I'm actually top, top 100, which I'm happy. I thought I'd be like, I don't know, 110s. <laughs> I actually don't have the lowest library card chat. Oh my goodness. Look, 8, 7 start on 117. And I'm 8 years. Let's go. I have a good tiebreaker for once. It's from 68 till 118, and I'm 8 years. Yes. I somehow miraculously have a good tiebreaker. Yes. I don't know how! I have zero idea how I have a good tiebreaker. But I have a good tiebreaker! That's like one thing a, year, a yearly opportunity I have a good tiebreaker. And I wasted on that 80s place instead of 100s. Yeah, but okay. I mean, it's fine, it's fine, you know. <laughs> yeah, it was the last game was unfortunate. Sure, in the 8th round, I could have drew, but it was complicated in the ninth round. I made a mistake with rook d4, and my rook on e was saying, I should play g5, it would be an easy draw. And in the last round, my opponent played well. Yeah, to pay I mean, it's not that terrible. It's not too, too bad, you know. It's not the best, but it's fine. All right, chat. So I think I'm going to end the stream. Pretty decent tournament. Would be better if I would get... Uh, 
out of three, out of these three games, at least half a point, you know, just half a point, and I could have grabbed it in both of these games, of oh, both of three games. Yeah, probably that's why. But it didn't, unfortunately. But okay, still, top 80. It's better than top 100, less than top 100. So, thank you so much, everybody, for the support. Who am speaking so much? I'm tired of speaking, actually. So, first of all, uh, two weeks ago and a week ago, Anonymous Gifted gifted, up, uh, Anonymous gifted, gifted two gifted subs each week. So, four total in these two weeks. Thank you so much. Then, Lorgan, 28 months at tier 1. Thank you so much as well. Then, Anonymous Gifted gifted tier 1 sub to the Snoopy Dog. Appreciate it. Then, BB Absolute 66 months. It's five years and six months at tier 1. Thank you so much. Karma, 100 bits. Then, Poker Bravo, 40 months at tier 1. That's three years and four months. Appreciate it. Chris Dami, 40 months at tier 1 as well. Then, Lorgan, I know, Pookie, 500, uh, 100 bits. And then, Lorgan, five community subs uh, to give it five subs to the community. <laughs> One of 80 best chess players in the universe. Very well said. Very well said. And I almost drew the top two in the tournament. So, Technically, he technically, I mean, I lost, but technically, I drew him before. So, technically, if you get what I'm saying, uh, you know, I'm top two. Come on, another 250 bit, thank you so much. And then, I'm just going to give it a tier one sub to Bexby as well. So, thank you so much, everybody, for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. And had fun. Bye, Karmar. Bye, Bing Me Absolutely. Bye, Crash Dummy. Bye, Bexby. Bye, Pookie. Bye, Lorgan. Bye, Anonymous, gi uh, Anonymous Gifter. I don't know who that is. Bye, bye, bye. Bye, Crash Dummy Rage. Bye, Pookie. Bye, Bing Me Absolutely. Yes, bye, Lorgan. Bye, bye. Uh, to Vampire Rage. Bye, bye. To. Ooh, yay, why is this chat scrolling down? Ah! Stop. Vampire Rage, Karmar. Abacus. No! The chat is scrolling down. Okay, I'm gonna read here. Ah, uh, yes, 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 uh, Steiner, Steiner Botond, take care, Pookie, Vampire Rage, Lorgan, Karma, Tubelerchik, uh, Lorgan, yes, 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 Be Me Up, Snotty, Vampire Rage, and everybody who came, Poker Bra, and everybody who came here to watch. I hope you enjoyed and had fun. Uh, you can redeem Dexter's all day. Yeah, I can, but I think you can only redeem one reward a day. Uh, so... Hold on, can I actually redeem? Let's play Dark Chess with myself! <laughs> Wait, how much can I redeem? Chat, let me redeem another Dark Chess game. Yes, now I own myself two Dark Chess games! <laughs> Hold on, let me, own, let me get another one. Now let me play a blindfolded game against myself. Yes! <laughs> Alright, Chat, thank you so much for the support and for having me.